Okay, we're going to drill a hole. We're going to come in 891 thousandths of an inch. Um, my X and Y coordinates don't work on when I drill in, but I do. I did put a new gauge on there, um, which will give me accurate measurements too. Uh, that's a one inch drill bit. This here is a six inch piece. We're going to pull out 891, or we're going to drill in 891 thousandths of an inch, and we're going to pull back out, and then we're going to start uh, expanding that area with another tool. Um, so we're going to be using liquid coolant on this, a very complicated setup. Uh, hopefully I don't wreck my nice gauge, um, and I hope that I, you can see the gauge in the video. So let me put my helmet on. Uh, I'm going to keep it at 200 RPM. Let's see, it looks like everything's ready to go. So got my safety gear on. So here we go. Let's turn it on. Okay, remember this is high speed steel or um, stainless steel, but I have a high speed drill bit. So the drill bit is going to be not as hard as uh, the stainless, but that's okay. I can sharpen it just a huge bit with the tapered uh, base that goes right into the unit. There is no a regular drill chuck or anything like that. So let's get this thing started. Okay, so we're starting to grab my tips in the hole a little way, so that's okay. So let's turn on the cooling fluid here. Start pulling out some chips. Okay, I'm going pretty slow, being pretty conservative with this big bit. So let's come back and say we're starting, I'm taking a side angle there. Um, I'm going to be pretty conservative on this thing. So let's do eight right there. So there's one. This will be. Oh, nothing breaks. Thank you. 
So let's take a peek at this real quick. Uh, I'm sure the filling system is making huge uh, differences to this cut. Um, it did stay cool. I mean, this is hard steel. 400. Some discoloration on the, the stuff coming out. Okay, I'm gonna have to stop a bit here because my gauge came off. It's not registering anymore. So anyway, um, turn the coolant system off. Okay, so um, let me come in there with the camera to give you a better view of what's happening. So this is my setup here, and if we come in and look at the hole, you can see the hole that we've drilled so far. Now remember, this is a, a big bit. This is a one inch. I mean, there's my finger. It's wider than my finger, and um, so, but we're getting, um, those are all the chips that have come out from that. This is um, heavy stuff. So... Anyway, I'm going to readjust this and finish this, and I'll show you the finished product later. Anyway, time to get to work.